Welcome to another episode of the Rags to Riches edition, and as you can see, we're- Ooh! Whoa! 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 <laughs> uh, we just got attacked by bats. Selena isn't too concerned about it. After all, she got a bit of plasma bat bait that is sure to interest the bats more than her boring exploring self. Don't know why they attacked in the middle of our house, but they did. So, as you can see, we're gonna have breakfast real quick, uh, go to the bathroom, and then head down to the market to buy some more of the supplies that we need. As you can see, we just used up some of what we had, and they, we never ended up getting any food. So we're gonna need that if we're going to be out for any good time, period. This poor stray puppy. I hope it's okay. It has food. I feel like we need to uh, maybe run a vet here. I think that would be kind of cool. I mean, I can't imagine this little tiny village has much in the way of a vet and there's lots of animals out in the jungle and I bet a lot of these people have pets. As I see, as we can see, we already have a stray dog, so maybe that's uh, maybe that's our new calling is being a vet out in this world. We'll see. But first off, let's get what we need. Here we are back in the market again and we're buying ourselves a ready-to-eat grilled cheese. We're going to buy one of these dolls and we're going to buy one of these baskets. I don't know if any of these are meant for the jungle and keeping us safe. So we're just going to see what we need and what we don't. We have a shower. We have some energy. Oh, I guess I could have used that yesterday. Oh well. Uh, we have the spider repellent. We have a lot of shouting in our ear. Food, basket, doll. I feel like we have the bat bait. I guess that's all we need from here, right? Because this is just spider and we have the bat bait, so... Oh no, we're out of it. So we don't need to buy one of these again. Alright, so let's grab that. And then... Oh, this one doesn't have it. Psh. Purchase that. Alright. Alright, so we can... I figured we'd look at what we can do. We can ask about... Uh, supplies? So we're going to ask her what, about the supplies, and then we're going to ask her about something else. If you don't see what I want, check back later. Our inventories change a few times a day. Okay, and then finally, buy exploration supplies. Let's see what that does. Ooh, okay, so it gives us a new selection of stuff. Oh, we could have bought food for our pets. Okay, so that gives us a roadmap to love. <laughs> so it's just a book, a romance book. We've got beds, a violin, a book, tiny brushes in you so that will help us with our archaeology skill. We've got tents, sleep beds, books, guitars. We could get a table to sit at and a workbench to uh, check out our stuff. We've got sleep less, jog more. So I imagine either that's just something to read or it helps one of your skills general camping stuff. I wonder what's here if you don't have Granite Falls pack. I can't remember what it's called. I apologize. But I wonder what they have here if you don't have the other camping stuff or the other camping pack because most of this stuff comes from the other pack. We've also got lanterns. I don't think we need any of that kind of stuff. I think we're good with what we have for now. Okay, so I thought maybe you would be able to unlock these little question marks as you go, but it doesn't seem to be the case, or we haven't gone far enough, um, because we would have been up to this point when we quit the last episode. So either it doesn't unlock, period, or it only unlocks once you've done everything. I can kind of see that they would never unlock it because then you'd have a way to fast travel in. I don't know, we'll have to see. But here we are, back in the jungle again. Let's go through this guy. Let's see if we have to go through seeing jaguars and stuff again well, as we travel through, or if we'll get kind of a pass because we've been here. Okay, so we got a pass there. Let's change into our exploring gear. We don't want to be going in a skirt. Let's go through this guy. We made it safe through that direction and this is where we left off. So we've gathered from the... Ooh, let's do it again. Harvest. Did we get the cutting that I... Or did we get distracted? I don't know if we did. So I also want to get that to cutting. 
so that we can grow it in our gardens easily. We can just stick it on a plant we already have and it will just start producing the fruit opposed to starting it from the low tier. So when we finish doing that, what else do we got? We could grab this stuff. We'll do that real quick. What else do we have? We can go in here with all the little fairy lights, which looks amazing. And that's got a jaguar. We can go through here and see where that takes us. Ooh, there's so many choices. And then we have a main door here. This path is sealed shut. It cannot be opened on this trip. Perhaps next vacation it'll open? <gasps> what do you mean? I wonder if that's a way to go cut, like, uh, a shortcut. So she can now study art and artifacts for historical insights for further improving her archaeologist skill. Get out of here, hijinks festival. Or we can go this way. Man, when there, I have these like choices, I wish I was doing this uh, live so that you guys could tell me which way to go. Because I don't like having to make the decision myself. There's a little like area there, but I don't think we can actually go there. So let's go inside. Because that's not something we've done yet. Can you finish doing this already? Alright, so we got a, an artifact shaped dirt clump. So that's probably something we need to uncover. Yeah. So we're gonna paw our way through these vines and see where it takes us. Yay! We got through. And she entered it. Oh, and we have these guys again. So uh, while blazing a trail in the jungle, she comes across a small group of capybaras hanging out by the watering hole. As she observes them, she notices one of them is approaching a huge swarm of bees. The capybara doesn't seem to have noticed the impending danger. What do we do? Do we wait and see, scare off the bees, or wave around a flower? This uses up a flower we do not have, but we can't just let it get stung. So let's try scaring it off. She wants to save the poor thing from pain and getting stung, so she starts waving her arms around and yelling. The bees swarm immediately turns in her direction. Unfortunately, she falls into falls over a log while fleeing and gets stung all over. That's fine. The little guy's okay. Would we like to go to the temple? Yes. All right, here we are at a temple. What's this look like? Let's give this a pause. She's not just oh, can't pause in that camera mode for whatever reason. So we're in this like lovely temple. Oh, wait, I remember checking this one out. I thought it was weird because you couldn't really interact with it in any way. So this is probably somewhere you travel, like a separate area from where we were, technically. So let's see what we can find. Here's the da door. Here's the little bush for our convenience. We still kind of want to wait to eat because I don't know how much it fills it up and I don't want to waste our one, uh, unexpiring grilled cheese sandwich. I'm checking out if there's anything on the outside of this temple before we head in. There is all of this over here, but I don't think we can enter that way. It just looks cool. Here's another little area that we could excavate, but I'm not interested in doing that right now. And there's another one. All right, so let's go inside. Can I just lower the, yeah. Ooh, cool. All right, so. Let's first start out with, I don't know. I don't know how to start or how this works. That's funny. I can't actually go into that room. So we have something to dig and a plant inside. What's upstairs? A thing to dig up and a cool view of that tree. All right, so ooh, let's see if I can try to pass. There's all kinds of cool stuff. Is this, oh, we can swim. Oh, can you throw a ball for your dog to go fetch in the water? <gasps> We've got to try that sometime. I did not realize, but anyway, let's go ahead and start exploring this thing. Ooh, maybe there's a puzzle. Let's not try to pass through that door. Let's go and just like stand here and see what we can see first. So it looks like there's indeed some kind of trap situation going on here. Um. So we've got stuff to harvest, stuff on the ground, and we have little wall things like that guy. So we have leaves and we have waterfalls. There's three of each. What do we got on this guy? We have the trees. Oh, we do have the leaf one. 
so we can activate let's examine it and see what that says we still have these bowls that we can examine and comfortable oh yeah because we got stung at least that guy was safe we're gonna examine that guy see what we can find out so all, all I've gathered are leaves and waterfalls I don't know how those interact with these maybe I don't know let's see what she has to say so we finished examining it though it took a lot longer than it seemed like it sat at being like a full green circle for quite some time so that was a little weird but we did just get a pop-up she figured out some of the triggers won't work to unlock the gate but it doesn't rule them all out she can try her luck by activating a trigger or she can keep examining other mechanisms so let's go ahead and so we have assemble arrowhead glyphs leaves or suns really seems like it should be the leaves right because there's three leaves over here make this into three leaves all right let's just see what happens when we do that oh god okay so we gained some logic skill for narrowly eva avoiding danger or disaster our sims can die uh from this pack by the way uh, and there's a there's a surprise guest here. Uh, I don't know if I'm prepared to deal with a walking skeleton. Just saying, that's not cool. Not pleased with this situation. <laughs> All right, let's see what happens. Okay, she's freaked out by the bones. Hey, buddy. Okay, so doesn't seem to be doing anything bad. So let's uh let's just introduce ourselves. I don't know what I just missed, but <laughs> it says hey, it's just like a like another sim. So a narrow miss. Phew, she made a mistake when trying to disarm the temple's defenses, but I got away unscathed. Need to be more cautious next time. So we got confident from doing that, which is kind of funny. But so we know what when it's not. Let's t uh, see if this guy has anything. I think this is supposed to be like a chubby sim, but he's bone, so he's just kind of got a wide skeleton. Got quite the hips. Hey there, buddy. What's your name? Sans. So we can pretty much do the normal stuff you would do with any other sim. All right, cool. Uh, enjoy being you, and I'm going to examine this stuff. All right. Thanks, buddy. All right, so she figures out some of the triggers won't work but to unlock the gate, but she can rule them out. Okay, activate. It's not the tree glyph. And it's not those two. Okay, so we've examined them both. We've narrowed down two on that one, one on this one. Should we examine this and see if that helps? No, that just study for insights. I think that causes... Um, like an increase in her skill, but doesn't help with this situation. Ooh, interesting. Okay. We can't also continue examining because we've already examined it. Can we examine this? No, we can try to pass, which would be dumb. It's flaming. <laughs> All right. Ooh, that bolt looks really cool. Well, I'm going to sit here and think real hard on what to do. All right. So we just tried one. <laughs> uh, this arrow head and it didn't kill us it just spun around did nothing so let's go ahead and try doing the suns because that's the only option left we have gained some logic skill from avoiding disaster again though so that's good oh i think i realized what he's doing when we aren't watching oh no uh he's playing his his ribs like an instrument i think we just got a dart to the throat I don't I've gotta say it's probably not a good plan <laughs> well let's see what happens all right so now we're dazed from being poisoned something isn't right the icky feeling could either go away on its own or get worse only time will tell maybe acquiring an antidote would be the safest so it's none of this this one had nothing to do with it it was this guy all along Okay, so wrong activation. What's this? That a poison dart stuck into Liana. She's definitely not 
did not activate the right trigger and the temple's defense defenses are punishing her for her mistake. Well, hey. Um, I don't know where we'd get an antidote. I haven't seen an antidote yet. So, uh, let's... She's just gonna go do that. She's gonna view it. Well, let's do one more thing and see what happens and, uh... Maybe go home after that? <laughs> no, I want to do leaves. I don't want to do arrowhead. I want to do leaves. <laughs> we got another dart to the neck. Cool. Uh, that probably doesn't help our situation. Well, let's have a sandwich. Eat grilled cheese. What's this guy do? Place in the world. Okay, it's just a thing to have. So we're gonna sit by this pool here, get in our swimsuit. Oh, we don't look good. We, uh, we've been better. I don't think that was it. Alright, we're good. One last one, which is the sun. And if this isn't it, I don't know what it is. <laughs> Alright, so that one was the right answer. But I don't know why. Ooh. So the fire has stopped. Very nice. Let's give that a pause. She has bypassed the temple's defenses and the gate that has opened. She could now venture further into the temple and find what award rewards await. Uh, she has been imbued with blessing of the ancients. This joy is infectious and can spread to others that she comes in contact with. All right. Well, let's go. Uh, oh, Bones is heading upstairs. That's fine. I don't want to. I don't want to follow him or anything. So let's go down here. Oh no, it's another one. Man, I feel like somehow I missed the solution besides just testing and and guessing, you know? Like, there's no suns anywhere in here. <laughs> I wonder what or how you're supposed to know or if it's just a skill your sim develops. Like, as she gets better, will she be able to look at it and be like, okay, it's definitely not those three and then we can continue? I don't know. I am curious. Can I put my tent in here? Can I put it up here? Because if we could heal up by sleeping, that would be good. Nope, nowhere to place our tent. That's too bad. We can have a liquid rush though. Do we need it? No, we're actually mediocre on pretty much everything but our fun. So apparently she doesn't mind almost dying a bunch. So we've got three bones down here. Let's examine that. Let's examine this and examine that and see what all happens. Well, let's see if it's this warrior because it's only got one option left. Woo! She had bypassed the temple's defenses and the gate has opened. She can now venture further into the temple to find what rewards await. Woohoo! We did it! Let's uh, take care of some of our needs though. She uh, she passed out in the bush she took a wee in so that was probably not good. Uh, let's see, we can eat these black beans and take care of the shower. Let's see how this looks when she uses it. It's just bubbles. Bubbles everywhere. So now she feels cleaner. That's good. What other needs does she have? That, a food. There's not much I can do about the food right now. So for maybe eating this guy. Let's eat a couple of those. Get ourselves energized. Woo! She's now energized and we'll finish off with... I've been trying to look for this thing right here. Take a drink of that and let's head back into our new open area which is down here and see what we can see. Examine that one. Examine that one. I wonder if there's something to do with those. Ooh, there's a chest too. Can we examine these guys? No. Let's open that guy and hope for food. Alright, so we found some simoleons and adventure gear. I'm glad for the money. What'd we get? We got some fire foam. Don't stop, drop, and roll. This foam provides all the oxygen deprivation you will need without all the rolling around. Caution, children cannot use this. It contains chemicals hazardous to their health. Okay then. I don't know if I want to 
eat that mus or use that myself. I'm gonna have her eat that spoiled salad. Hopefully that helps fill her up a little bit. All right, so she ate that spoiled salad. Let's go back to examining everything. All right, so we've examined them and we haven't figured out everything. We have two options here. And in this one, we have the one. So let's go ahead and try the one with the one option. We also have 30 minutes until we find out if we're going to die of the poison. So we'll see how that goes. Oh god. She was unable to fight off the poisoning and has progressed and gotten worse. Might want to do something about that soon. Okay. We also did the wrong activation. Uh, she nearly soiled her clothes with that one. Now I'm pretty sure she straight up soiled herself. I don't think it was an almost thing. Yeah, all right, so next episode we're gonna try to see what we can do to feel better. Um, the poison is coursing through her veins. Better find an antidote quickly. Surely someone in Salvadorada knows what to do. Maybe research online? We don't have a computer at our home, so hopefully somebody somebody can help us back in town. But we're gonna have to head home at next episode. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and until next time, I hope you have a wonderful day.